is a Hi, I'm Cosmo! We have to read the book! We have to go have read a good book today! Cosmo! We have a Fair Arbor's book? Yep! We have a story! It's called The Fair Arbor's Long House Recess! Shh! Her! We. There was. Th sh her! We have a. A story book. Book on. We have a. We have. Cosmo, we have a Feral Arbor's book? Yep, we are reading the story today. What was the original sn. Feral Arbor's Long Hot Recess. Tim and Turner and his friends were at school. Even though it was recess, they weren't having much fun. It had been, been raining for two weeks straight. I'm bored, Timmy said. Me too, his friends Chester added. Even I'm bored, said their friend, AJ. And I never get bored when I'm doing complex math problems in my head. <laughs> After school, the guys went to Timmy's house to play the, the new Crash and Apple video game. I'm still bored, Timmy said. After, uh, said after an hour. Me too, Chester added. I'm even, I'm bored, and, and I just got free extra lives. And AJ eat my board dust. <sighs> Timmy decided he really, really needed to talk to his very godparents. He stepped behind the TV set and pulled the cord out of out of the wall. Zap. Crash Nibble was gone. Hey, AJ shouted, just when I was about to get crowned king of planet Cromelon. Oh well, better luck next time. Timmy said, here's an umbrella f for the rain. See ya. Hmm. Timmy ran up the stairs to his room to find Cosmo and Wanda. Hi, guys, said Timmy. Listen, cool, school's boring, really, said Wanda, but it's so educational. And the rain, Timmy continued. It's boring, really, but it's not so wet, said Cosmo. I don't care, Timmy said. I'm bored. Uh, I'm tired of school. Tired of school, and I'm tired of, of of the rain. I'm even getting tired of the of video games. Well, I'm getting tired of Wanda, but don't tell her that Cosmo said. Why can't I have an idea? Continue, Timmy, f for a super duper dull wish. Cosmo mm. Wanda flipped through the pages of the rules. Well, well, look at that pl at 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 of the rules. Well, look at that. 
you're allowed one super duper duper double wish per year. <sighs> cool, Timmy said. He rubbed his hands together. I wish for it to be summer, sunny, all the di uh, all the time, and I, I wish it was summer vacation every day. And with that poof, Dimzel was wrenched in sunlight. Uh, kids poured out of their homes and onto onto the sidewalks. They were everywhere. Cool, Timmy yelled. It's just like summer morning. He r r ran downstairs. Where are you going? Timmy asked Mrs. Turner. You should eat some cereal before you catch the school bus. Mm, Mr. Turner said. But look, guys. T Timmy shouted as he collected the TV on, on, on its summer vacation. In Dimsdale, all the time, and boy, is it sunny. This is Chet Bubetcha signing off. See, no school, Timmy said as he ran outside. Hey guys, Timmy pushed through the crowd of kids bobbing. The ice cream truck. To find Chester and AJ. No more rain. No more books. No more truckers dirty looks. I scream you. I scream. You scream. We all scream for no school. Chester cried. Timmy and his friends. Stayed outside for hours eating ice cream and playing. Woohoo! Let's hit the sprinkler, said Wanda. Cosmo yelled, Sweetie, don't f forget to wear your sunscreen. Wanda said, You know how you burn. Here, son, Mr. Turner said, try on my new Ultra Deluxe Sun Blockers. <laughs> he handed Timmy a pair of sunglasses that looked ordinary, except for the huge umbrella attached. Wow. Thanks, Dad, Timmy said. As he put them on, I think they work a little too well. I can't see a thing. The next day, Timmy had ice cream for breakfast. And played with his friends all all day long. By the twelfth day of Dimsel's permit for summer vacation, Timmy was still into into routine. Not everyone was quite excited. The sun was so strong that one could escape the bright sunlight. Long enough to fall asleep. <sighs> Even Cosmo and Wanda weren't their usual perky selves. Wah! Cosmo cried. His face was bright red with sunburn. It hurts. I want my... Want my mommy 
and my mom is sunblock. Hmm. Timmy pointed at Wanda. Those eyes were closed. Hey, Wanda, are you asleep? Uh, Timmy asked. Wanda struggled to open their eyelids. My eyes feel cracked as as a uh, as a broken eggshell. I can't fall asleep because it's still too bright out. If only I could wish this wish the sun to stop. Wanda said drowsily. Timmy went outside where where Chester and AJ sat slumped against each other. Ready for another fun filled sun filled day? Timmy asked. I'm tired of the sun, said Chester. Let's go to, to the arcade, AJ. It's one of the only places that isn't sunny. But I fought the whole point was to be outside since, since it, 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 it is sunny. Timmy shouted after them, Ugh, guys. <laughs> hey, Turner, called a familiar voice behind him. Timmy cringed, Vicky. I'm babysitting while your parents go to the new all-day night tennis courts. Vicky said, you want to be out in the sun. I'll keep you out in the sun. Now hose down the lawn. She stumped in into the house. <laughs> this stinks, Timmy said. The sun has made everyone too tired to play. I miss Wanda. I miss Crash Nebula. I even miss the rain. But it isn't this what you wanted, asked Cosmo, appearing by Timmy's side. It seemed a lot more fun in my head, Timmy said, sighing. <sighs> Just when, when Timmy got an idea, he ran into, into the house and grabbed his dad's sunglasses. Hey, twerp, Vicky screeched. Are you done with the lawn yet? I need you to slash her sunscreen on my dear dog Doyle. Right? Timmy said over his shoulder. That's, n that's next on day. My list of things that I can't wait to do for you. In the in his bedroom, Timmy placed the sunglasses on his windowsill. His room went dark. Okay, Wanda, you can can get some sleep now. Timmy said. And when you wake up, we can get back to, to exercising our brains. <sighs> the next morning, Wanda w was more like herself. Even Cosmo's sunbird had faded to a nice shade of pink. I guess you guys w were right. Timmy said it's better to have... Half day and night, sun 
and rain, school and vacation. So Timmy wished for things to be back the way they were 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 rain, school and all before but but before he did he made one last promise to his godparents. I promise you guys that I'll never ever say I'm bored. I'm sure you won't, Timmy, said Cosmo and Wanda. Sh sure you won't. Hey, Wanda! Is it a great story or what? Yeah! It's a fine story. We are signing you off!